Hello guys, it's Shemus, and today I have a Beyblade unboxing. This is Lucifer, the end. So, this is going off on Christmas Eve, but I'm opening it a few days early. Well, well, before it goes up, I should say. And, uh, I just want to say right now, this thing is so late. Um, it was supposed to be here quite a few days ago. I know the USPS has been having a lot of problems. So, this thing came pretty late. Alright, just getting the tape off really quick, let's see. Once I do that, we'll see if I get a rare uh, disc. And yes, this does use a disc. It's actually my first Limit Break Bay. That's also why I'm um, uploading this so late. And, no, that's fine. Uh, I don't really care too much about those, but... Yeah, and there's the sticker sheet and whatnot. These are foil stickers, by the way. I won't be using them, but I'm just saying. So yeah, this is my first Limit Break Bay. I will be getting the other set for Christmas, which is why I'm uploading this um, now instead of, you know, as soon as I get it, because that way... Um, basically, my idea here is that I get the other Limit Break Bays up, like, just a couple days after this one, so it's not, like, too long of a gap. I don't know if that makes any sense or not, but... Alright, sorry about that, that took like forever, anyway. And zoom in, we'll go to manual focus, and we'll start showing each part individually, and then we'll go over the whole thing. Um, So first up we have this driver, uh, Drift, and Drift is very, very strange. So it's like Mobius, that free spins way better than Mobius ever did, but then you have this whole piece, so it's like just LED, Yeah, so if it like tips, it just goes onto this and it's just like really, really good. Now we have probably the worst part of this uh, bay, which is the disc. This is one of the new Limit Break discs. Um, this is called Co. And it is definitely the worst um, the limit break disc, I would say. So let me... Yeah. It's actually a lot bigger than I, uh, thought it was, but... Yeah, um... I think, I'm pretty sure it's the lightest one, and also, uh, it activates the limit break ability after the third click, which is not good. Uh, especially, I think O is just better in, like, every single way, um... And then you have Cho, which I think Cho's shape is worse, but it activates on the first try, uh, on the first click, I mean. Which is pretty good. So this thing's kind of just not great. Now we have the layer. I'm going to try and see if I can figure out how the chip separates from everything else. Um, before I show this, if I can. Just give me one second here. Okay, it literally just pops out, that makes sense. Alright, so we'll start off with the Lucifer 2 chip, which is pretty heavy, actually. Looks very cool, I like it. It has like a rubber, uh, little rubber stopper in there. Uh, it's a burst stopper, yeah, it looks really cool. Also, the purple on that, um, is metal. And then there is the end. Let me go ahead and line everything up to put it in its regular form, essentially. Oh boy. Okay, this just looks awesome. Got more rubber here, I think. I think that's rubber. I'm not sure, actually. So again, let me... All 
All right, so when I put this together, first I'll just show you the, the chip on there, which looks nice. You can see the little red, the, the rubber in the middle there. But, uh, yeah. Anyway, go ahead and put this thing together. Something like that. There we go. Keeps wanting to pop back out. I mean, this is my first impressions. I've never had a limit break bay. I don't know what I'm doing here, so. Yeah. Yeah, this thing looks great. And then once you, you know, click enough, uh, eventually it'll, essentially it'll, you know, pop open and then everything, you know, starts free spinning and I'll just show the layer. And you'd see everything just free spins on its own. You'd see, you know, this top piece is separate from this like little purple piece here. And then the underside is like completely separate as well. So there's literally three different uh, parts in here that are spinning individually, which is kind of crazy. Also, I'm going to put this thing together so you can actually see uh, just how far down it goes. Because you could probably have seen earlier, uh, there's a pretty, you know, like the disc kind of stuck out a decent amount. And then you could just see now it's like down to the, the driver. Um, of course, that, you know, free spins. See, so yeah, it's a really weird bay. Um, I really like this bay. I'm going to be honest, I was not hyped at all at first when I first uh, heard of, you know, we were getting a new Lucifer. I'm like another one, really. Um, I thought Variant was already pretty cool, but I don't know. I kind of like this thing. But yeah, that's really all I got to say about it. It's really, really nice overall. I'm a big fan of uh, this new uh, Lucifer. Looks really cool. But uh, yeah, anyways, that's all for this video. So thanks for watching and bye.